Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, we're out here enjoying the weather on this beautiful afternoon. And I currently have no idea where I am. I know where I'm trying to go. And I'm just kind of like, uh, like I, I looked at a map. I actually tried doing a GPS, but my phone's being a piece of crap right now. So I couldn't get GPS. So we are out here enjoying these absolutely stunning views and this absolutely stunning weather today. And I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. And I hope if you can get out and ride. Uh, I'm out riding just getting lost today. Oh man, it is so pretty out here. Um, so on another note, be careful riding on roads you've never been on that you don't really know because it's real easy to overcook corners especially if you're up here like if, if you're anywhere in the northeast because you get a lot of stuff like this where there, there's a tree can't see the corner i know it's going up a hill and to the right that's it i know where the entrance of the corner is but i don't know where the exit of the corner is same thing with this you got to watch out with the blind hills and i do always slow down for blind hills just because you never know what's going to be on the other side uh and in, in my car i've as a teenager been ripping down back roads like this and come over a hill and there's someone pulling out of a driveway a tractor in the way a semi truck you never know so just be careful with with blind hills and blind corners as well because you never know what's going to be around them so that's going to be my little tip for the day is watch out for blind corners and whatnot Blind hills, blind corners. Yeah, be careful, especially with stuff like this. Because you never know. Even though the speed limit is 55. People still get mad when you hit the speed limit sometimes. I, it, it, it happens, unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah, so I've think I'm going the right way? I have no idea. Just out here getting lost uh, enjoying being on two wheels and I suggest everybody else do the same. You don't necessarily have a destination. You don't have to have a destination to go to. You just got to get on it and go. Which, which is usually what I do and kind of how much time I have kind of depends on what direction I'm going to go. But today I had a little bit more time but not a whole lot. So I'm coming this way. Actually, I, I did have to do something. Um, 52. Ooh, do I want it? Crap, man. Yeah, see, because I don't. I feel like I should go that way, but I want to go that way. Uh, this is the problem. I don't, you know what? We're we're going we're going right. We're going right. So apparently we're just gonna go get lost. And uh, shit, it's a nice day for getting lost, man. Hay fields, shit everywhere. Uh, actually, that's one more thing. So I'll, I'll leave you with this too. Especially if you ride in an area where there's a lot of farms, especially this time of year, um, it, just be on the lookout for, for clumps of hay in the road. Uh, the, the farmers actually don't do it on purpose, but little pieces that they don't see can fall off their equipment and stuff, and that could cause you know an issue for anybody on two wheels. So, uh -oh, somebody got a deer, and um, yeah, so I'm, I'm going to leave you with that, and it oh, looks like they're still mowing that field, and uh, everybody stay safe, keep a rubber side down, and have an absolutely fantastic day. Until the next one, I'll see you.